Ukrainian media sources, Inforesist Org, UNNCOM UA, UARU Info, Glavret Info, Superative Info, and some others spread the information that the self-defense forces intimidate civilians with the stories about the airstrikes of Kyiv region. According to Ukrainian media, there were no airstrikes. Let's listen to the people of the village Lugansk. What do they think about it? Ударил самолет, ударил по райотделу милиции, когда бомбили по мостам, разбомбили школу, разбомбили суд, там тоже, говорят, люди пострадали и пожилым домам лупило. Нигде никаких, никого нету, ни военных, ни, ни вовсе нету лишних людей никаких здесь. И среди бела дня летел самолет и скинул четыре бомбы подряд, четыре, вот ямку засыпали, там в конце огорода, вот. И по улице дальше вон разрушили все дома. Погибло я не знаю сколько человек. У меня кумья оторвали ногу, умерла. Ukrainian media, Ukrainian Pravda, Glavriet Info, TV Channel 24 and Zirkala Nedeli told that the self-defense of Donetsk had proved the information that Russia supports them with weapon and military hardware. The only evidence that the media could give were the words of the activist of the movement Suti Vremenia, Essence of Time, Sergei Kurginyan. He is famous for his leftward populist views. It was the argumentation kind of, we've seen the pics in Twitter. Ukrainian mass media report that the inflation had been slowed down on 1% from the beginning of the year and the price increased following the results of previous 5 months is only 11.6%. The journalist mentioned that price for some items have even fallen down. But the media do not tell about the price for tariffs of heating energy for heating energy had increased on 27%. Of course, this theme is not interesting for Ukrainian journalists.